Hey guys, welcome to Random Fix. I'm here in Alaska near Denali. I've been booking my stays on Airbnb and some of the options that come up is these tents. They're called super tents. So when I first saw them, I was a little worried because I wasn't sure like really what they provided, what kind of amenities they had, and if I was gonna enjoy the experience with the family. And in Alaska, it rains and sometimes it gets cold. The temperature really fluctuates a lot. So I'm going to show you guys this super tent behind me now and it's pretty cool. I've actually had the best rest in that tent and I think I paid about 20 or 25 bucks per night for it. So really great stay here, especially near Denali where most things are going to run at least $200. And it had electricity so let me turn the camera around and I'll show you guys the inside. Alright so this is a super tent. That is a regular size door. and right here it's gonna be wood and there's a screen mesh that goes all the way around and on top of the screen mesh they actually have a, a white tarp here really well lit and you got plenty of light um, if you do sleep in here you're gonna need something to cover your face uh, we had one of those small throw pillows we use that to cover our eyes so the light wouldn't make it into uh, our face area so definitely cool really spacious um, there's electricity right there it works for at least charging your phone or using your laptop but two beds you got extra blankets in here if needed I actually use my own sleeping bags on top of the bed which is super easy um, and I picked up the sleeping bags at I think Walmart for about 10 to 12 dollars um, and it has a table with four cups water uh, some bug repellent and stuff which I didn't have to use a broom um, and just a garbage uh, just a can right there so you can get rid of your trash but really overall great stay if you guys are considering a super tent this has been my favorite uh, place to stay in all of Alaska because the sleep was really good very serene the kids loved it you really got to take in the whole Alaskan experience and it's really easy on the wallet as well. That's a Yuriko tent right there. It's pretty cool. Only thing is it's kind of dark inside. But definitely worth the stay if you haven't tried it out before. If the weather is really bad, that might be a better idea. And if you're new to Airbnb, I'm going to have two links below. One is going to be for renters. The second one is if you want to become a host. And for clicking on those links, you might get something a little extra as far as signing up. So definitely try it out. Airbnb completely rocks. Alright guys, I hope the video helped you guys out. If you guys got any questions about Alaska or about coming here, please comment below and I'll be more than happy to answer those for you. If you got your favorite places in Alaska to check out, definitely leave them below uh, for everybody else to consider as well. Have a fantastic day. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and smash on that notification bell so anytime I post videos that are aimed at helping you with your travel tips or fixing cars if needed, uh, you guys will get notified. Have a great day. Thanks.